Hey fam, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, joining me for the first time, my name is Chef Fran. But first, give me a virtual hug by hitting the subscribe button and I'll give you a new recipe every week. So today we're making our one pot chicken and rice. Really simple. We're gonna have some yellow rice with chicken. So, um, but we have to put our veggies there because we gotta get our vitamins. Here's our vitamin content. And so we have orange, red, and green bell peppers, our chicken, our onions, our garlic. The rice has already been washed. This is our basmati rice. It's already been washed. You can use any rice that you have at home, whatever you like, your family likes, that's what you use. I'm using chicken broth. If you don't have chicken broth, you could always use some water and some bouillon cubes. Um, I do have also some better than bouillon that I'm gonna add here. And this chicken was just seasoned with some olive oil and some Montreal seasoning, some onion powder and garlic powder, and a little bit of black pepper. So fairly simple. You can use whatever seasoning that you like that works for you. And to get our yellow color, we're gonna use two things. We're gonna use turmeric, not just for its coloring, but for its health benefits, as well as some uh, sazon with the saffron. I have some chicken breasts here. Now you can use um, boneless chicken thighs if that is what you like. Um, I prefer chicken breasts and no, it's not gonna dry out and be all dry because we're gonna have all these wonderful flavors in here that's gonna keep it nice and moist. And then I did leave a couple pieces whole just so I could have like on the top for, as, you know, presentation on it. So, um, my chicken breasts are really, 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 really small because I use an organic brand. And again, use whatever chicken breast that you like, that your family likes. But I particularly like this brand and the chicken breasts are really tiny. I'm actually gonna add more seasoning to this because when we add our liquid to it, you lose a lot of your seasoning and your flavor because of the liquid. So just gonna add a little bit more. Even though I have some fresh onions and some fresh garlic here, this is like a secret to every base cooking, adding garlic and onion powder, it does make a difference. Okay. And all the ingredients will be included. And here are a list of ingredients. Okay, so I'm just really trying to get my chicken to have a little bit of a color on it. You know, before I go in and like toast up my rice a little bit before we get to making a full on chicken and rice. Gonna add a little bit more oil to the pot. Okay, so now my chicken it's good to go. So I'm gonna take them out, my pieces, and then I'm gonna put my vegetables in here. We're gonna keep all the goodness and the flavor that's down below here. That we had a seasoning called the fond. And that's we're gonna have that in our rice. There's my pieces. My rice pieces. And then my rice has already been clean, like I said. Ready wash it to remove some of the starch. Get the vegetables in here. Have all that flavoring. And any of the thickness that you see down here is gonna come off once we put in our liquid, our broth, our wine. Okay. So now let me get our vegetable here. bell peppers and the onion I'll add the garlic a little later because I don't want it to burn get all that flavor up 
here. And then my rice. And I'm going to change my cooking tools to my spatula from my tongues. I'll incorporate my chicken back after. So I actually like to add my turmeric on my rice while it's dry, actually. And then I'm going to take my packet of set on one packet since I have the turmeric going on. A little bit more turmeric. And I'm going to add now my cup of white wine. My garlic can go in now, now that I know it's not going to get burnt. And I'm going to start with my broth. I'm stirring. I'm going to add my chicken back in once I have the full thing of broth in. thing of broth in here. Some better than bouillon. Another thing of broth. Let me add my chicken back in. Okay. Add my chicken in here. I'm going to add the bigger pieces on top last and the smaller pieces inside. Okay. These are my smaller pieces of chicken. So this is our one pot meal that could alleviate us washing a whole bunch of dishes. For the extra flavor that I have in here, it's going to go back in the pot as well. So you reduce your heat. Well, we've completed our one pot chicken and rice. Everything was done all in this pot. Save you time, you only have one thing to wash. And I have my wonderful resident taste tester here and he's gonna let me know how I fared on our chicken and rice with our little veggies in here. Well, it looks real good. Okay. Rice has a very good texture, very light, fluffy, cooked perfect. The chicken has a lot of flavor, and with the vegetables all together, it's all blends together real good. From a young palate, you hear that? Very descriptive. So now let's chef give her taste. Okay. The rice is very flavorful. Super light, like he said. Basmati rice tends to do that, has that for you. Get a little the veggies here and a piece of chicken. Chicken is super soft. Yeah, very easy to cut. Very super soft. It is not dry like many may think because it's not dark meat. This is actually very good. You have a full meal here. You have your grain, you have your meat, your protein, you have your veggies. So what more would you want? Comment below if you're used to doing chicken and rice, one pot, save yourself a whole lot of eggs from cleaning a whole bunch of dishes, or let me know if you tried what I did. We really appreciate you hanging out with us today. And come back and see us again in our next video. Love you. Bye. Subscribe for more delicious recipes and vitamin details. Also, your support will continue to allow my channel to grow.